Recently, I did a video on this no-name telephone bell ringer. Plugs in the telephone line, has a jack on it for you to plug in another phone, and an on-off switch, and obviously, as we heard, a mechanical bell inside. I had mentioned that there might be another one of these that possibly was different that I know I saw at Ace Hardware. So I went looking for it, and it so turns out... Where were they all coming from? From me, Doc. I'm multiplying, see? I'm multiplying. Yep, there's two of them. This one has been stored for, I don't know how many years, but years, many, many years, in a plastic tote bin out of the package, just like this, just in there. And look how yellowed it is compared to this other one where I don't even remember where I found it. <laughs> this one is considerably lighter than this one. That, of course, won't affect the functionality, but even the cord has changed color, if you can tell, which is interesting. Either that or this was the same thing in a slightly other color. However, this really does look like it has yellowed some uh, instead. Uh, once again, absolutely no markings on here whatsoever. Your on-off switch, your jack, and nothing on the bottom except made in China and the two wall hangers. Little different. A little bit higher pitched, and this one is a little bit lower pitched. Well, let's go ahead and test this out, and because I can, we'll put them in tandem. So we'll do a couple tests with that. Okay, as usual, I have about 5 million other projects going on, so I had to move this over here, and that's also where the phone line happens to be, so that's kind of a nice plan. Uh, this is the one that we're looking at today. It's turned on, ready to go, so let's ring it. With that done, let us now hook one into the other. Ding! I'll turn that one off, and now we can hear the difference with this one, which seemed to be a little bit higher pitched for whatever reason. Here we go. Now we'll turn them both on and have them both ring because my telephone line can now handle that. So we'll redial and here's both together. They definitely have a different sound to them. Let's do that one more time, and what I'll do is I'll frob the switches on them 
So you get one, then the other, you know, so you can hear one right after the other. So we'll dial one more time. I'll shut this one. Does it ding when you... No, it doesn't ding when you just turn it on. All right, we'll shut that one off and leave that one on and call. So yes, they have multiplied indeed. I don't remember if I bought this one at Ace Hardware and took it out of the package. I have a habit of doing that, getting rid of the packaging and that and just storing the actual unit. So that may be what occurred, or maybe I came across it in my travel somewhere. I don't know exactly where it came from, except that it's here. And that's really all I can tell you about it. <laughs> so, yes, they are mechanical bell ringers. I did uh, also look on Amazon, and I did a very cursory look, to be quite honest. I did find one. They wanted, like, 33 bucks for it. Even Ace Hardware was not ripping you a new one for that kind of money. Now, again, I really didn't do a good search, and there are plenty of other sites you can look for these on where maybe they're not going to charge an arm and a leg, because sometimes you can look stuff up on Amazon, and it just has an absolutely astronomical price for no reason, and then you find another site that's like a quarter of that, and you could buy it there. Even if you have to pay shipping, it's still like worth it, you know? So, <laughs> I don't know, but there's two of them. And they do both ring, and they sound ever so slightly different. <sighs> kind of like, I, I have this notion in my mind, like I want to put one of these out in the screen room. But by the same token, I kind of don't. Because the weather is going to get to it. And even if I sort of shield it as best I can... Everything outside just gets this, like, black filth on it. And that's going to get in all the vents here and inside of all the units and maybe eventually, quote-unquote, gum up the works. And that would not be a good thing. So I don't think that's really happening. Although I did find another ringer thing on Amazon that plugs in the phone just like this, exactly like that much thinner. It looks almost like a deck of playing cards. That's like the size of it. And the styling almost makes it look like that as well at a quick glance. You're like, is that playing card? No, it's not. That has an electronic ringer. And I think I found one for what, $6? $6. $6. It's almost like, why would you not have that? You know? Well, I don't like the phone disturbing me. Okay, well, just, uh, you, you know, not a lot of people even have home phone service anymore. Don't complain about what you don't have that you don't want because you, know, you don't know that you need it. That did make sense. But anyway, that's it. So another one of the same uh, left in the toaster a little bit longer than that one. Uh, that's it, yeah. So, thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Make sure you click like, make sure you click subscribe, and take care. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.